here, Jen. They definitely are, Thomas. I'm at Cambrian and Clidach Vale football ground in Tron Navaud. And the win yesterday is particularly important for this area because Rob Page, the Wales coach, is from Llwynapia, which is just a mile and a half that way. And the last coach to take Wales to a World Cup, Jimmy Murphy, is from Pentra, which is just another few miles up there on the valley. So let's speak to a few of the young footballers here tonight. Lucas, you're particularly proud of what Rob Page has achieved, aren't you? Yeah, it's uh, amazing. He came in at such a difficult time. And he's transformed the players and he's given them fire. And he's uh, really got us to that moment where... You know, we're ready for the World Cup. I mean, the win yesterday is so big for just Wales as a whole and the development of the players who can get into the Wales team soon, hopefully. And Jack, you were in the stadium. What did it feel like and did you feel inspired? Yeah, it was absolutely amazing yesterday in the Cardiff City Stadium. The atmosphere was electric and um, yeah, one of the best experiences I've had in a long time. Has it made you want to improve your game and maybe play for Wales one day yourself? Yeah, really. Yeah, 100%. Um, yeah, I'm open to... Yeah, yeah. Represent your country. Yeah, represent my country. Esme, you already play for Wales, don't you? What age group do you play for? I play for under 12. Gosh. And what was it like to be in the stadium yesterday? It was class, and I really enjoyed it. And Lori, you play for five teams. Tell us which teams you play for. Um, I play for Hopkins Town, RCT, Cam Bryan, and my school. And I play for... Lots of teams. Yeah. Too many to remember. Yeah. Right, Brian Hopkins is one of the coaches. Uh, Brendan Hopkins is one of the coaches here. I mean, what does it mean to these players to see Wales perform on the world stage? I think it's massive since the, the first European campaign, just to see how the, the country's got behind the, the national team and how that's transpired into grassroots and, and local football. It's, uh, it's massive. And what does it mean to Ronda to see a, a local man leading the team to a World Cup in Qatar? Again, I think from us, from, from the Ronda, it's a very close-knit community, a very passionate community. Um, I think we're a community that's been overlooked in the past for, for players and, and lots of different kind of talents. We've had a, a huge emerging talents come through that's been overlooked, so hopefully this can now uh, inspire the, the next generation to go on and succeed. Fabulous, right. I'm going to ask these players who their favourite player is. So, uh, who was your favourite player yesterday? Dale. Gareth Bale. Nico Williams. Connor Roberts. Right, a bit of a variety there. I'm going to let you get back to your training. Who knows, maybe one day one of these players will be representing Wales at a World Cup. I certainly hope so, Thomas. Back to you.